Talk about Aisha Buari. Aisha Buari, you are fat. <laughs> eh, you are fat. And it's our money that you used to get fat. Send your DSS, come this side. <laughs> send there. If you don't send that, your DSS, come this side. You <laughs> Aisha Buari, you are fat. Capish? Capish? They don't invite the boy now. I mean, come the follow them, the negotiate. Though. That woman should be in jail. If Aisha Buari is not in jail, then there's nothing like law in Nigeria. If Aisha Buari is not thrown in jail for abuse of office, she doesn't even have an office. Constitutionally, there's nothing such a such thing as office of the first lady. This is a made up office where they use all our money, they waste on top of their wife. So that their wife don't go feed, they monitor them and their girlfriend. You know, their, their wife don't feed, they monitor them and their girlfriend. For all the girlfriends they fuck everywhere for the world, from London to Ethiopia to they carry women up and down, guess where they feel born, their grandchildren, just mounting everything with whole. Male and female. Male and female. These girlfriends are not only female. They are male and then they are female. They can't create office of first lady for their wife to distract the wife from monitoring what's going on. Now, Nigerian DSS. You see this energy? Now I'm going to rewind and reverse all of us to Malami, our uh, so-called attorney general. Malami say Nigeria knows the name of all the Boko Haram sponsors. They are not mentioned one name. Neither have they arrested one person publicly. Neither have they arrested one person in public. Say, this, this is a sponsor of Boko Haram. But they, they say they know who Boko Haram is. But they've not exposed. But they can't mention the name. But they have the energy to go to a boys' school. Because the boys said something that is patently true. I mean, just you, all you have to do is look at the first lady. Look at Aisha Buhari's picture today. Even Buhari himself. Buhari don't take Nigeria money young. Buhari young, so they, people say, is Jubri. <laughs> money, Nigeria money change Buhari, so they, People say Buhari is no longer, this is Jubri. <laughs> Are you... Now they say you are you are fat from Nigeria's money. You are complaining. Aisha Buari, what job have you done in eight years that you go from the weight you were when you were campaigning for your husband to this robust size that we see today? This robust size, this made in Dubai, made in UAE, made in Dubai size. Hmm? How come? What job are you doing? If it's not Nigeria's money that you have eaten to get, what did you do in these eight years? Because I know that legally, constitutionally, you are not allowed to do any job. So it's Nigeria's money. I know they, they won't allow that boy to sue up. See, if that boy or any of his advisors are listening, sue that woman to court. Don't let anybody beg you for anything. Even though they will not give you your money when you win. Even though nobody in this country will fight for you to... Uh, nobody in the... Not in this country. Nobody in the executive arm of government will, um, will execute that judgment. Hmm? Will execute that judgment. 
you must fight it. You must fight it for the precedence, for the precedence of it. You must fight it for the precedence of it. You know, this is what all Nigerians should be on today. This is all we should all be giving our energy to this to this matter. That in a civilian dispensation, somebody says something, and not even the president, the wife of the president. In fact, some reports, I don't know if this is true or not, but some people say she gone, she joined her and they beat the guy. Say she joined her. Anyway. Anyway. But you know the problem with Nigeria? Urgent 2K. You see that urgent 2K when they always talk. Many people now that 2K na dollar. Urgent to, see somebody here say so see leave that guy matter. The guy support Deborah killing. Imagine this. So because he supported uh, the killing of Deborah, means that we should expunge his human rights. I don't understand the way we think. That's how they test some Nigerians say. Is they run for a uh, judge where to go stadium to go and watch his son play for another country? Judge where is the president of Liberia? All of them begin say, hey, Now you call, am I the president of Nigeria? Don't you understand that the president is different from any other citizen? The president, once you fight to be president, you are no longer a man, you are now an institution. As since Sidan J, they support America. It means Liberia. The whole Liberia is there supporting America. It means Liberia is supporting America. That's a treasonous act. 